Hey guys, I'm Zachary Gray, and this is the Black Widow Spider. Alright, so what we got here, we got this little mineral tub for cows, and there it is. All this is her home, basically. She's got all this webbing everywhere, she put all kinds of stuff in it. What I'm going to do is get her to crawl on the stick. There we go. That is the Black Widow Spider. And it's one of the most dangerous spiders in the U.S. Even though there aren't a lot of deaths from this spider, we have the brown recluse and the, um, the black widow and the brown widow. Those are basically the only truly deadly species that we have in the US. I got the web on the stick a little bit to where she would want to climb on it. I'm trying to keep her as still as possible. Can you see her? There we go. Yeah. And they're an arachnid, which means they're going to have two body sections, the head and the abdomen, and they're going to have two sets of four legs. So they're going to have eight legs in total. And they all have very different patterns on them with their red. Um, there's the southern, the western, and the northern in the U.S. And they come by those classific they get those classifications by the, uh, the markings on them, the different markings in the different areas that they're from, which is pretty cool. We have two species of widows in the U.S. We have the brown and the black. And the black is a little bit more popular just because it's a little bit more identifiable because it's solid black with that red hourglass on its stomach. The brown one you don't really recognize as much. And in Australia they have a very similar species of widow and it's called the red back spider. Basically it doesn't have that hourglass formation but it has red from its belly to its back in a perfect stripe. way direction. There we go. Gotta make sure not to get our feet. There we go. Perfect. Alright. For how dangerous they are, they're actually really, really fragile. I'm trying to be careful not to hurt her, not to crush her, not to squeeze her in any way, not to break anything off them, because they're just so, so fragile. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, definitely leave a like, and I'll see you guys next time.